The Ministry of Economy and Finance has released the Un International Monetary Fund's assessment of South Korea's economic outlook. The IMF projects growth of 3% in 2022. It also commended the South Korean government's fiscal policies, which it said had spurred a healthy recovery from the pandemic. However, it says the nation's growth has been relatively uneven in recent times. Kim Yun-sung with the details. an optimistic outlook for South Korea's economy. The Ministry of Economy and Finance on Tuesday released the final results of the International Monetary Fund's annual Article 4 consultation, where a team of staff assessed a country's economic situation and policies. The IMF rated South Korea's comprehensive policies highly for minimizing long-term scarring and pushing for a speedy post-pandemic recovery. The IMF also projected growth to be robust, for supply bottlenecks to be resolved, and the Omicron-battered economy to quickly bounce back after the first quarter of this year. South Korea's projected GDP growth for 2022 stands at 3 percent, with prices predicted to increase 2.5 percent. The 3 percent projected growth in GDP falls below growth estimated at 4 percent last year. It is, however, a big jump from the figures during the first year of the pandemic, minus 0.9 percent in 2020. The IMF added, however, that recovery has been uneven. Labor markets, some service sectors and consumption has been slow to return to pre-pandemic levels. Also, with the global uncertainties heightening, stagflationary pressure may rise with it. In order to combat these two problems effectively, the IMF had several suggestions for policy response. They recommended that Korea broaden the tax base and that the country strengthen automatic stabilizers. Pension reform also remains crucial. They further advised Korea to push through the Korean New Deal to foster growth and inclusion. Bringing down entry barriers in the labor market, encouraging female participation in the labor force, and breaking down market rigidities were all ways recommended to promote inclusiveness. Finally, the IMF also commended South Korea's green initiative for areas such as carbon pricing. Kim Hyun-sung, Arirang News.